It's all gravy, understanding a unique English expression. Hello, everyone, welcome to our English language learning channel. Today, we're going to explore the phrase, it's all gravy. This is a fun and interesting expression used in English, and understanding it can add a little flavor to your language skills. So, let's dive in and find out what it means and how you can use it in your conversations. The phrase, it's all gravy, is believed to have its roots in American English. Gravy is a sauce often made from the juices of meats that are cooked, and it's generally considered a bonus or an extra treat in a meal. So, when someone says, it's all gravy, they are essentially implying that everything is going smoothly or is better than expected, much like a meal that is improved by the addition of gravy. In everyday usage, it's all gravy is a colloquial way to express that everything is fine, or that even if there were problems, they no longer matter. It's often used to convey a sense of relaxation or satisfaction in a situation. For example, if someone is worried about a small problem, and you want to reassure them that it's not a big deal, you might say, don't worry, it's all gravy. Let's look at some examples to see how this phrase is used in real-life situations. 1. After solving a problem, we finally fixed the bug in the software. It's all gravy now. 2. In response to thanks. Thanks for helping me out. No problem, it's all gravy. 3. To express contentment. I didn't get the job I wanted. But I found something else I like. It's all gravy. While, it's all gravy, is the most common form, you might also hear variations like, it's all good, or, everything's gravy. These expressions carry the same meaning and can be used interchangeably. I hope this video helps you understand and use the phrase, it's all gravy, in your English conversations. It's a great way to sound more natural and relaxed when speaking English. Remember, language learning is not just about grammar and vocabulary, but also about understanding the cultural nuances of expressions. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next video.